hey guys welcome back to my channel if you don't know who i am or you've never seen my face before i would highly recommend going back to my first video and watching it so you can get to know me today we're gonna be doing something different well technically it's not different because it's just my third video so we don't know what different is for me but you know different so we're gonna be trying on my grandma's wig right i think she knows i have it but you know she also might have forgotten that i asked to borrow it because i asked to borrow it a while back and i haven't used it and i was like this is the perfect opportunity to do so so i have okay i have pictures of before and after i washed it because it was a hot mess when i tell you hot mess hot mess so i had to like wash it and clean it before i wore it because i didn't want to wear a dirty wig you know so pictures of before and after will proceed yeah and when i washed it that water i had to like wash it i could say three times before like i washed okay so i soaked it the first time the first time i wasn't even planning on soaking it it's because when i put it in the water the water had turned yellow and i was like whoa like whoa i didn't even think that like i thought the wig was dirty and i'm like in my mind when something's dirty you like imagine a brown water but for some reason it was yellow i didn't know why i'm not like a wig expert so i didn't know why it was yellow so i let it soak for a while and then i drained it let it soak i let it soak until like the water wasn't yellow anymore and then i shampooed and conditioned it but i instead of like regular conditioner i put in leave-in conditioner because that's what i have and that's like what i use on my hair but like when i was like putting it on i was like should you be putting leave-in conditioner on a wig because like you know like you usually put in leave-in conditioner in your hair so that your scalp you know your hair can absorb it it's a wig so nothing's gonna be absorbed you know you know what i mean you know what i mean but i put it in anyways and it like made it shine so i was like oh maybe i did something right maybe i did something right so disclaimer i've never worn a wig before i have dreads so like this is gonna be probably difficult and it might not be done right it might even look bulky but this is my first time wearing a wig like or attempting to wear it better than just placing it on my head you know but i braided my hair you know the wig cornrows some might call it i don't know who called it that but the wig cornrows i braided my hair I actually just kind of like this. I might like just wear it out sometimes like this, but you know, I did it just for the purpose of wearing the wig. So I have it here. Okay, and I know some of y'all are gonna be questioning from the pictures. You got y'all are gonna be like, why is it on a jar of pretzels? Like what is going on with the jar of pretzels? I don't have one of those head mannequins, okay? So that's why that was like the only thing I had that I could like hold it up and to like brush it and everything. So the jar of pretzels, you know, it's right here with, you know, the beautiful, the wonderful grandmama's wig, you know. I like pretzels, so that's why there's just a big jar of pretzels that I have it on. So first of all, the conditioner made it smell so good and it like added a shine to it and another thing too because it's an old wig when i was washing it i thought that it was going to be shedding like crazy like i thought there was going to be no wig left to wear but you know we got it we we about, we about to we about to get into it so i got the caps a while back oh i dropped it we it's okay though it's okay we got it it's okay so I got the, you know, the caps that people be putting on. I don't know who people's is, but you know, people put on when they put on wigs because I really was trying to do this professionally and I watched a bunch of videos on how to do it. Like all of them were lace fronts and I'm like, I don't know the difference between a lace front and a grandmama's wig. 
so you know I didn't get none of like you know the glue and all of that that wasn't you know I didn't get that because I didn't think one I'm broke at the at the moment at the moment I am currently broke so couldn't bought couldn't have bought it if I wanted to and two ooh, I'm, I think they sell these in your skin tone unless like I think they do they sell these in your skin tone I think they if they don't they should but like I usually just see people putting in like you know the foundation that they use that matches their skin tone that's what they put putting in and they cut it but you know we don't have all of that you know we don't we don't have all of that time and we don't have all of that equipment so we're gonna just do it the way we can the way we came here to do it which is just bougie and basic i definitely will be getting my grandma and my mom's reaction to this because when i was washing it last night my mom was like oh you got yourself a wig and like she really didn't realize that it was my well her mom my grandma's wig and i was like yeah i got myself a wig okay all right so we gonna i have my mirror behind me that's why i'm looking over there very much so often because i like i want to see like make sure everything looks how it's supposed to so i'm gonna leave this should i leave this on how do you do this like how do y'all be doing this looks complicated hold on so there's like a a strap I think it's supposed to strap to the back of your head so that nobody can snatch it you know how people be going <clears throat> snatching wigs and we don't want that you know we don't want nobody snatching this so I think you gotta put it on like a helmet okay 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 wait wait a minute we getting somewhere ladies and we are getting <laughs> I don't want to even I don't want to look up <laughs> okay wait 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 Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold on, we gotta, we gotta adjust it. Ooh. Okay, we gotta, come on guys, bear with me. This, <laughs> <laughs> hold on. Hold on. I need to stop looking at myself because it gets funnier and funnier the longer I look at myself. So we're going to brush this out. We're going to... Rapunzel with the bundles. <laughs> Unstoppable is what I am right now. Unstoppable. We got to... Okay, we got to... We got to fix this, honey. Yes. Yes. I feel like the back is definitely going to look bulky just because like again dreads especially when you braid dreads they get thick or then i'm oh i like how you can't even see the thing you can't see the cap at all you know it's not a it's not the best wig like it's my you know it's my grandma's wig like she wears this for everything so you know what i actually did want to do though i wanted to like you know cut it and make it look nice because i'm not not the bang yang. <laughs> the bang yangs. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, girl. Wait a minute. Maybe no, I did something. Bang. I cannot see actually. But oh, oh, if we cut this. No, not the bang yang. Jesus. Jesus. The bang yang. Jesus. Oh, oh, actually, whoa. we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. Okay. Because I couldn't see and it was getting all over the place. But I think it looks good, guys. Like, given the fact that it's a low quality wig, I'm not even sure if this is real human hair. Like, it could be, I don't know what wigs are made of, but it could also not be. Like, it looks nice and shiny. And I really think it's because of the leave in conditioner that it looks like this. Mm -hmm. And I feel like, okay, let me give you all a sad view of what's going on. I don't know if it looks bulky. I hope it don't, but it might. It just might. But it sits right, and I feel like if somebody tried, oh, 
Okay, if somebody tried, they could. They could snatch it if they wanted to. But we're not going to let them get the chance. We're not going to let them get the chance to do that to us. Because that's not okay. We're not going to give them the chance. Ever secure the wigs, ladies. And I guess that's why, like, professionals use glue. It makes sense. Like, the glue was never confusing. But I just can't. I just couldn't find not couldn't find i just didn't want to do that right now especially since it's not my wig but i feel like i am i like i feel like i am gonna start wearing wigs guys y'all not gonna see the dreads for a while actually i feel like <laughs> oh baby <laughs> who grandma are you finna who grandma this is actually harder to do than it looks just because the thing is right here but I can finally, I got enough, you know, loose hair to do this. And people, oh, <laughs> period, period. Wait, let me do the other ear. Let me do the other ear. Wait, wait, it's not cooperating. Period, 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 period the head fall. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, I did it. I did it and I look good. This is what it would look like, guys. If I took off my dress and I decided to flat iron my hair and chose this bob haircut type style, I feel like one of those ladies in the 90s, you know, those like 90s women who just give me like a headband. Yes. Yes. Tell me if this is a look because I will buy this wig for my grandma because I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Like it's it's really just giving me like night like disco girl vibes. Like one of I'm feeling it. Okay. Now that I have the wig on, I'm gonna stop right here. I'ma put a hoodie on so that they can't see it. And I'm gonna bring my grandma and my mom in here one by one to just get their reaction. 12 seconds later. I have my grandma here with me and she's gonna react. Ooh, my mama. Oh, what? Really? She doesn't speak English, but I'm gonna put subtitles. Uh oh. My bad, my mama. 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 My bad, my Oh, 12 seconds later. So I have my mom here now. She speaks English, so we're gonna maintain the English flow. Yeah, no, no, you speak English. Okay, what? Are you ready? Are you ready? <laughs> mom said it looked nice. How do I look? Bye bye. <laughs> you look nice. <laughs> do I look good? Yeah. Period. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. <laughs> this would this. 10 out of 10. This. She gave me a 10 out of 10, guys. Yeah. 10 out of 10. I look good. I look great, you know? One eternity later. Okay, guys. So I got everybody's reaction. So my mom thought it was hilarious. She, she gave me a 10 out of 10 for the rating. And my grandma, she also thought it was funny, but she went like, she went on a, she didn't go on a rant. It wasn't a rant. She was just telling me how like they wasted the wig. Apparently it was longer and like the bang, the bangs weren't there. And somebody like cut them like that. So I guess she's still mad about it, but it's okay. But tell me why. I asked a third party for their opinion and they said, okay, my feelings shattered, okay? They said I look like the girl, you know the black girl that keeps saying that she's not black, bro. The one that's like, she was on Dr. Phil and everything saying that she's Caucasian and she can't, that girl. I'm gonna put in the clip, bro. If I've been white since the day I've been born, then I'm still white now, and I will be white every day I wake up. 
most uh -huh. definitely. There's nothing out here that can change my opinion, not some hood. They said I look like that. So I'm never wearing this wig ever again, ever again. We're gonna take this off right now because I am offended. I am disgusted and I can't. I just can't, like why would, why would they even say that like that? Like, why would they even? Why would they even say that like that? But yeah, I'm okay, I'm good, I'm good. I recovered, I recovered. But I like this cap though. Like, it reminds me of a swimming cap and it's just so sleek, so nice. I actually will probably start buying wigs. Like, especially since all Halloween is coming up and I'm gonna probably buy a wig. Ooh. <clears throat> <clears throat> wow my voice just exit my voice just left but yeah i'm gonna be probably buying a wig depending on the costume i still haven't decided yet but depending on the costume i'm probably gonna have to buy a wig so you might see me in more wigs and okay update life update like quick life update i'm going to be going to haiti november 11th which is a tuesday and i'm gonna be doing a vlog type situation so like on wednesday the video that's gonna be posted is gonna be the vlog of like me going from america to haiti and like the whole shebang of how all of that happens so like i might the video is gonna be real rough right because i probably won't have that much time to edit it but if i do i will so yeah and then we're gonna be in haiti for over two months so most of my so from november to like january beginning of january all my videos are going to be in haiti um i'm going to maintain my schedule but like if like you know internet issues and other stuff like that get in the way i do apologize in advance and but if i don't end up posting videos as regularly as i want to or as regularly as i should i will be making up for it with more videos and more content but i do plan on maintaining the schedule of posting every wednesday um yeah that's basically it that's what's coming up right now life wise uh, i hope you guys enjoyed this video i had fun doing it because that was hilarious but it's hot like it's actually hot mind you it's not even hot in my room the wig alone just made me hot I actually enjoyed recording this but you know as usual if you do not like to hear me talk you can go on my Instagram and follow me and just stare at me if you like to hear me talk but as not not as much and want to see me dance mediocrely go to my TikTok and follow me there see you guys next time bye